Hello. Welcome to this podcast. Uh, my name is Justin Jao. I am the founder and the CEO Justin Jao Services, JNS. I am a scientist and a prophet. And being a scientist and a prophet is out of a gift. Because uh, when I was a university student, uh, I started investing in, uh, in equal spirituality. Uh, you know, there is difference uh, between someone who is religious and someone who is spiritual. It's not the same. Being uh, religious, you'll be following a cult. Uh, because, uh, you know, religion, even the churches we have in Kenya, uh, like the Catholic Church is from the Romans, uh, the Anglican Church, uh, you know, it's from England, Church of England. And then for a church like Presbyterian, it's uh, from Scotland. So all they practice is Scottish. So that one now is a cult. But when I talk of spirituality, what I mean is it, it's out of something natural. Because, you know, the way I have approached, it depends uh, with how do you approach God. Because you may be speaking and talking of God, but you don't know what you are saying. Because to, for you to know God, you need to have wisdom with a divine spark. And uh, the core spirituality, uh, it's out of uh, the core how Gekoyo, Gekoyo and Mombi are the founders or the original, the founding parents of Gekoyo people. So for them, uh, Gekoyo was created from Mount Kenya, uh, that mountain, Mount Kirenyaga, and you know it's called Kenya because, you know, Amkamba is unable to say Kirenyaga. So obviously that's why it was called Kenya. Because it, if it was someone who maybe from Mount uh, from Gekoyo people who was asked, uh, he could be able to say Kirenyaga well. You know, we were colonized. And uh, before being colonized, the churches were introduced because, you know, they came with a strategy. Uh, colonization was not just uh, like that. Uh, they had sent anthropologists prior, and uh, they went to go people saw how they were doing, uh, because even praying uh, the Mogumo tree, let me tell you that is wisdom, uh, because trees have omba energy, and omba, omba energy, you know, it, it's energy. And uh, it's the one which uh, has intelligence. So there is no way you can, even when you are a scientist, you cannot decide to annihilate a certain species of, uh, of the creation forever to destroy it. Because creation is not mechanical. Hmm? Creation is spiritual. So the reason why they were praying under that Mogumo is because Mogumo is able to take uh, prayers to God. Uh, God, God has given uh, Omba energy, that ability. And uh, for Mogumo tree, uh, the Omba energy is broader than other trees. You can pray, uh, you can pray uh, from any tree. You can even show your uh, kids because you need to start uh, teaching them spirituality because spirituality is natural. Mm. So now that mountain is connected to the Umpiran seat of majesty because we have uh, four realms, let me tell you. Because uh, you know the white man will lie to you that uh, because they don't have the aspect of the spirit realm. Huh? We have this earth, and then after you die, what changes time and space? Huh? Then there is no aspect of time because when you are uh, uh, in the world, uh, uh, when you are living, what you are given is time, and your time starts uh, from the time of birth to the time of death. Then after you die, then there is no aspect of time. Uh, you join the spirit realm, and the spirits can see us; huh? they can see and hear us, the spirits. But uh, ourselves, we are unable to see them because our eyes are limited. We, we don't have that uh, big ability. That's not the way we were created because everything was created by God. Hmm? But when we say of God who created, it's a God who dwells at Mount Kirenyaga. That mountain is even called Mount Zion, Mount Zion. Uh, because it's a place of peace. Even uh, many years before Jesus was born, it was called Taneter. But you, and you should remember Jesus was not a Christian. Uh, Jesus was a Jewish and he practiced Jewish Kabbalah, he had Jewish Kabbalah, and, and all, all he did, even the way, the, the way he was circumcised, uh, it was uh, the, the Jewish customs. So, remember that even you, when you are Gekoyo, you need first to approach God from your, from your Gekoyo nature, because before the churches, there is a way our forefathers were doing, and it doesn't mean that they were stupid, no, they, they knew what they were doing. Uh, because, let me tell you, God is not uh, about the people. Hmm? It's about all, everything. And God is not part of the creation. Hmm? Uh, creation is an idea of God. 
God is not part of this creation, but the work of this creation is God. God is the one who brought this creation. So everything, it, there is nothing which existed. Uh, God has always been existing. So you cannot know even uh, about God completely because you are just limited, limited. What you have is what you have been given by God. Huh? Because creation uh, is about the energy, huh? energy allocation. God allocated energy. The trees, they, they receive their energies. The clouds, they were given the energies. Water, energies. Humans, energy. But all the energies which are allocated, they were positive. Creation is pure. This is what we mean when you say creation is pure. So when you try to introduce negative energies, even if you are a government, and maybe you, you colonize people, you make them slaves, you do whatever you do, you create negative energies. And those negative energies are, are stored in cosmos. And those negative energies will be your fate because you know God is the one who, who rewards people. And the reward of negative is evil. And the reward of, uh, you know, of positive is obviously good because that's how creation is. You are supposed to be walking like God. Because let me tell you that the reason why you are able to do a negative thing is because God has given you ability to do so. The, the, the trees cannot do a negative action. They don't have that ability. But you human, when you do a negative uh, action, then you are responsible. So uh, all the things you do, you, you create energies. Action equals energy. And the, uh, and, the, and the energy you collect are the source of your strength. Let me tell you, for me, I can tell you much uh, about God because I can speak to God directly. We converse directly. The voice of God can pass through my brain. I have that telepathic uh, communication ability. This happened in 2023 when God spoke me for the first time in Moranga. I was in Moranga. And uh, from that day, we started communicating and uh, I, I changed my life changed totally. Because for everything I've been doing, it, it was how God me, wants me to do it. And uh, when I talk of God, uh, I, I, I can assess God through my co-spirituality, Gai Moenenyaga who dwells at Marikirinyaga, at the Upirian seat of majesty. Because when you talk of God, no one can tell you God without wisdom. For me, I have that wisdom, and I have been tested by death. Uh, God tested me with death. Uh, I was to decide if uh, to die, or you know, to forsake God. And what I, the, 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 what I did, I didn't forsake God, because for me, I meant what I said. When I say God, I had that spirituality for real. So... God made me, God gave me an altar, implanted me an altar. So there's something done to me. My, I'm not an ordinary human. I can uh, have a, uh, when I eat the food, uh, I, the altar which is implanted in me, we start doing some uh, things. So mechanical pulses uh, are there throughout my body. When I, when I have pain anywhere, any part of my body, there will be mechanical pulses and I will heal. So this altar is doing things which I were not doing before. So even the protection of the seven angels who are present in a, in a personal altar, and you cannot know about a personal altar if you don't have, uh, you, you are not connected to Mount Kerenyaga altar. Because that, 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 when we, where we say, thy, 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 and those are the words of peace. Because how you speak is science. You know, I'm a scientist, I can explain to you how you speak. All the words you speak can be even be heard by the spirit. The spirits can hear the, what you are saying because you are producing sound energy. And those energies, you know, you, you, you live forever. Those energies. This, cre this creation, you know, science is a work of God. So when you, you know about science, you know about the work of God. So you cannot be ungodly and wise. You'll be stupid. When you are ungodly, you are stupid. So we shall continue communicating because I can tell you a lot of things for sure. Because God has given you that wisdom. And uh, this program is called Kekogona Program. Uh, YouTube, you can subscribe. And uh, we shall continue. Thank you very much uh, for listening to me. Thy, 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 thy.